or did you just tune in? That's weird. I'm going to turn that off. That's annoying. Maybe that worked. Yes, exactly. There's no burbs here. Well, there could be. Somebody's texting me. No, I'm live. Yeah. I'm just putting stuff in that's like totally not in order. Bucket. It's easier to clean. <laughs> oh, another package of these two packages. Wait a minute. I just cut the recipe in half. Never mind. Cooking. Don't worry, it's clean. <laughs> Bleh. Okay, weird noises from the sink. Right, so half the three that would be. Um, a cup and a half, right? Okay, I'm smart. So you just want it lukewarm. Is, is enough, I think, yeah.
It won't let me see the chat for more than two seconds. And yeah, I, I died totally. <laughs> My friend gave this to me for my birthday, and I didn't want to take it outside to get it dirty, so I just used it for cooking. Ah, <laughs> uh, so, tablespoon and a half of salt, wait a minute, I have a half tablespoon up here. Yeah, I have all the fancy stuff. Yeah. <laughs> this doesn't look like a difference. This says it's a half tablespoon. Let's see. And then we just pour it into here and see. Oh, apparently it is. See? So a teaspoon and a half of salt. This is going to turn out perfectly. Well, hello, look who finally decided to join us, the bucket person. tablespoon of oil. Yeah, that's Feather Heart. So this is a... Okay, I just seen something. <laughs> a half tablespoon of stuff, so just add two and then you have a full tablespoon. I keep fe feeling like I forgot something. <laughs> Indeed, you are. And just wash your fingers again. <laughs> <laughs> so, Feather Heart, this is my friends that, um, from Discord that, like, encourage me to do art and stuff. They're good people. Yeah. <laughs> so it's... 
Okay, so it's 6.44, then we're done kneading it. Because you want to knead it for like... Um... <laughs> indeed. So you want to knead the dough for 8 minutes. It looks like we got it all mixed together, considering I cut the recipe in half. Um, three cups. Okay, but don't be afraid to grab a little flour and just like sprinkle it on your hand so you don't have all this. I don't see a bouquet. <laughs> But you don't want to add too much flour like that, or it won't be able to, um, <laughs> it won't be able to mix it together easier, as easy. Okay, oh my goodness. <laughs> so now that it's stuck together good. Yes, I cleaned the cupboard. But yeah, no one told me that in the tutorials of making bread. It was like those art videos that just like, um, they get you started on a sketch and then they're like, oh, it should look like this finished project and it's just does not show you the in-betweens. Somebody else is spamming me. Oh yeah, it's horrible. As some of the um, videos I've watched on um, breeding betas, it's just like, oh yeah, we just put them in a bucket and leave them and then the next day we check on them and then three days later everything is fine and there's eggs. Yeah, well, that's not how it goes. left. You're not going to get very much done. If you hold it down with this hand and just kind of rolled it back, then it's going to go faster. So you can just kind of absorb the stuff. Mm. <laughs> Some of them are and some of them aren't. It's like with the sourdough, it was just like, did not give you timing or anything. When to knead it and when not to.
I have, my hand has been absorbed. I no longer have a hand. Okay, let's just get some more flour. Yeah, it takes so hard, so long to find it, even if you can find it. So, while we're waiting for this to rise, um, what are we going to draw? I was thinking about something for a starting soon screen or something, but on paper. I don't either. Why is there just a string attached to my arm? My goodness. I hate this. Go away. They're hard to draw though, but I can. Okay, oh, are we like gonna draw a horse kicking a beach ball towards Donnie or something? <laughs> <laughs> because you know there is horse soccer out there. Yeah, that we actually have a ball to ourselves. So like you get a whole bunch of horses together and two people, one person stands on each end with their horse and they're like the goalie and um, the other horses have to get the ball underneath the other horse. That's And um, the other horse has to not freak out while they do that, so, yeah, <laughs> it's actually quite fun when you get a bunch of nice people out there. So, when I get bored of kneading it, and I'm trying to clean up the table, so all this extra stuff, I just roll it around. It is, it's really fun. Just kind of absorb all the extra flour so there isn't anything left. But it just... Just kind of like clean the cupboard with it. Oh, by the way, you don't want to like wash it down the drain. So like, see the extra stuff down there? I just leave it in there a day and then I can scrape it out and throw it outside because if it gets in the sink it will become concrete and your um, garbage disposal will die. Speaking from experience, of course. You're welcome. So that, yeah, that's why I cook with a bucket. And minimal tools. <laughs> yeah. I used to cook with sourdough 
and it's like worse than anything. take your milk straining towel and cover it and now we wait so while we're waiting let's go draw something get this garbage I have to walk over mom leaves all this garbage in my way trying to trip me like how rude where do you guys want to sit right here Yeah, you can sit there for a minute. By the way, I painted Broken Heart on my wall. So, um, where am I going to put you guys? Um... Okay, so it's like different calendars. I'll show you this one. This one is for the Charlet Association I got a while ago. So this is a ranch advertising their bull. It's his um, parents right here, his birth weight and weaning weight. I don't know what that is. Having ease, that's the shape of the babies, so they don't have a big head or anything. And the birth weight, weaning weight, yearling weight, that's what that is. Milk production of his bloodline. And just marbling, it's got all the information about him. And down here is all the sales that are going on. And then it just Here's Fink Charlet's. I'm not a fan of theirs because they're pot bellied. But they're it's just stuff advertising. So yeah. It just depends on the calendar you get. Actually, let's just go sit over here. That's my children's right there. I don't even know where to start. I left my eraser over there. Why would I do that? <laughs> See? Children's. This is my child. And this is the one that was playing garlic phone with me earlier. Oh, look at the little white spot on the back of her head. Oh, me too. They're just precious beings. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes it's nice to have lots of details, especially when picking out a bowl because you want the calves to be perfect. Hey, this is a mushroom thing I made. I don't know if you can see it. You can see the drawing behind it better. What? Mushroom. Mushroom. No. It's, it's gone. It's, it's there, but can't see it. <laughs> I 
Yes, of course, my favorite, a blank paper. <laughs> <laughs> so, how are we going to have it set up? Just <laughs> you know, that's an important one. We're just going to work with that. What was we gonna put on our starting soon? Oh, you can see the reflections! Or something. <laughs> they look like little velociraptors waiting to attack. <laughs> oh my goodness. Children's. Not right. Don't judge me. I'm not sure whether I want it to be scribbly or like more perfect writing. Like, should I have it like that and just have it smaller over here? Starting soon. <laughs> true, true. My phone says I'm the only person here. But there's three of you talking. That does not make any sense. Their heart, look at my children. The children's. I've never noticed that you can see them <laughs> through the bucket. This. Perfect. I have flour all over my phone. <gasps> I just had an idea. Ah. Uh. <laughs> they would get cold. Another bucket, yes. I actually have two of those because weekly I change it. And weekly there's more children to hatch. Uh... Uh, don't ask. I mean, there's one right here too. Um, it's more of a trash can, but I keep fish in it. They are. <laughs> So, like, our minerals come in these buckets like that, that was once filled with molasses and minerals and stuff for the cows, 
So we have like an endless supply of buckets. <laughs> yes. full of mollies right there that's like 12 little molly fish in there I'm draining this tank up here to put them in there and then I'll separate the girls and boys but right now they're in the bucket which is like a hospital tank so that fair bucket right there is that water and, yeah. Wait, does the beach ball have like four stripes on it or something? It doesn't have like a whole bunch of stripes, right? Yes, of course they can. From cooking to holding fish to um, whatever buckets are supposed to be meant for. Is calling me. Mm. Do I want to answer? Nah. They can leave a message. You know, the funny thing is, I told mom and dad that I had a scheduled stream. And then, like, as soon as I start streaming, they're like, What are you doing? What are you doing? I am busy. I am live. Don't come in saying important things. <laughs> I don't know. I think these children drive me insane sometimes. And by children, I do not mean those things right there. Yeah, they're more of children. But yeah. <laughs> okay. I may or may not have, like, made a letter too big. I wish I had copy-paste, like, digital art. <laughs> Okay, so the G is going to be like a little bit squashed. Nobody cares about the G anyway, right? Yeah. Oh, maybe I could just leave the G out, then it'd be like starting instead of starting. Does that sound okay? 
Yeah. Isn't that the one that goes, like, infinite? You can, like, make stuff like that? Do you think that would sound okay, like, starting soon, or would that be like, sound lazy or something? So starting, but the G won't fit. I'm either gonna have to redo it, or, I don't know. Okay. I'm going to write this one backwards. <laughs> okay, we just went over... Okay. Is that true? And me too, and mom always gets after me because she says it sounds lazy, so you know. I was just making sure. I'm tired, I don't know what to talk about. <laughs> Except children's. Do you like my children's? Oh, so I was on BC with somebody last night. Um, okay, so like, Last I counted, a month ago, I had 135. So how many childrens I have now, I don't know. <laughs> the numbers are increasing a lot every weekend. So the next time the incubator beeps, we'll go check on the dough again. What do you think? What you can see of it? It's perfect. So, like, the O, the two O's on soon, I'm gonna make them beach balls. Should I just have Donnie sit standing on the T, trying to get away from the beach balls? <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> yes, I am going to take over the world as my children and mealworms. I mean, technically they would be my children too, but you know, I can't count them. They're endless. Almost like my chickens will be soon. No one will be able to stop me. <laughs> Yeah, I'll brighten it up as soon as I decide if that's what I want to do. Are you still here, Featherheart? Nah, apparently not. Okay. Sadness. Did the incubator just beep? Oh yeah, there you are. Hello. Glad you're still here. <laughs> so, what do you want me to get you tomorrow? Because I don't know. Hi. <laughs> I thought that your birthday was going to be Monday. I didn't think it was Sunday, so. I want me to give you this eraser that I've had since I was four. <laughs> and when you erase on it, your paper, it makes it black instead of erasing. Oh, really? That's weird. Okay. Oh, so I was right. It is Monday. Okay. Just now I'll soak in then. I could give you one of these plants. Take a pick. Uh, I could I could give you some children or some mollies. Uh, um, there's some dirt over there, like behind the camera. Uh, I have this thingy here that I've spilled fish tank water on, so it's all warped. Wouldn't that be great to have? I'm going to give you something really dumb because I don't know what to give you. <laughs> Should I give you a bucket? It's like another bucket. Well, at least you got it to live on. I'm gonna... I did throw out the other one I had. What did I do with the pot? Oh. Okay, the pot is gone. I do not remember what I did with it. But I threw out the old spider plant. Because it was looking ugly. 
and I had others up here. been 30 minutes, right? Let's go check the dough. And we zoom down the hallway. Okay. Look how much that's raised. If you stick your hand in there, you can actually kind of feel warmth. Oh, the pan. Yeah. I'm gonna start getting delirious. I'm so tired. Like, what is that garbage in my pan? My goodness. I think mom was helping with my pan or something. Let's just wash it out. I don't even want to know what it is. Once you get it to here, it's pretty simple. So I'm going to take my spatial paintbrush and grab some of this butter and put it on the paint. I need to be some in the corner a little bit. You can put the brush back and the butter back in the cupboard. Because that's where butter goes instead of the refrigerator. Nice that looks. You want some here, Featherheart? Just, just have some bread stuff. It's perfect. <laughs> so, once you got it perfect, you just kind of want to shape it. So whatever you're going to put in the pan. And you can either make a loaf of bread out of this or um, fried bread or uh, cinnamon rolls, just, just about anything because it's just dough at this point. There you go. Fit. A little sticky thing. And you want to get the butter brush again. Just as soon as I put it away, you're going to want to paint it on. <laughs> yes. 
Good idea. And I'm gonna beat totally. Yeah, you, you're gonna. I'm gonna beat. That's like, um, does did that mean you only have ten subscribers? Not true. Also, hello, tablespoon. I have your cousin right here. Nice. I didn't have not. <laughs> Okay, so how are you going to compete with my 70 to be 78 million subscribers? Because <laughs> I'm going to get there someday soon. That possibly, maybe, uh, kind of, sort of, I don't know. <laughs> Still stuff on there, get off. Yes. People lie when they say they're subscribers, they are subscribers. <laughs> Do pretty good. Nice. Keep that up and you'll catch up with me. Do you see the oven? The second shelf is gone. Okay. Mom has been remodeling apparently. Well now, welcome to Broken's Appliance Repair. It was baking and... Yeah. Did she catch something on fire in the oven? Like... Nice. Okay, so like, look at... It's, there's ashes on it. How? I don't even know if I want to turn on the oven now. Uh, but to answer your question on what temperature, um, 350 for like 40 minutes or something with a loaf this size. Eat the ashes. Eh. They're delicious. 100% recommend. So then you let it sit in there for an hour, let it raise, and then you turn it on for, I like to aim for 40 minutes, but where we have um, butter on it, just wait till it's kind of a golden brown, however nice you want it. I am actually concerned about turning on the oven and finding ashes in there. It's 
Somebody came into my house. Ma? Oh. He's just dead. Oh, okay. You got a sticker? <laughs> Maybe. Uh, no, 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 let's not blow up half of Boise. Nibbles has filled a chair with pellets. Yeah. Look what I made. You made that? That's pretty awesome there, Chuck Liver. I tried to sell it for an urn, but he said that people only pay two to five hundred dollars for an urn. Mm-hmm. I turned it eighteen hundred. Mm-hmm. That's what I think it's worth, but Tablespoon says hello. Hello, tablespoon. Chop liver said hello, tablespoon. <laughs> Oh, you're on the video? Yeah, we're live. Hello. I made this because I'm awesome. Chop liver is amazing. <laughs> and chop liver made this. Everybody can see the grain. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm glad you enjoy it. Made this. It's a rock. Yes, we made a rock. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Everybody say good job, chop liver. Yes, I'm chop liver. <laughs> See how the grain matches the top to the wall? Yes, it's this big. <laughs> and it, it's got, see the nice lid, everybody? Pretty nice, yes, you're welcome. Thank you for all the accolades. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, and I have nice hair too. <laughs> I think you find that really Tablespoon said you have the nicest hair. <laughs> Thank you, Tablespoon. <laughs> it's clean now. I don't even know what to say after that. <laughs> oh, this still go in here. But is it? I don't know. You be the judge of that scene. It's, just, it's clean. Is it clean? I don't know. Nice. I am kind of got back into edits for a little bit, but between animating and this takes up my free time, so I do edit once in a while, but not like real serious because I don't have a lot of memory on my phone. Well, thank you guys for joining. I hope I could teach you something through my chaotic clumsiness. <laughs> um, do I like basketball? Like to throw at people or something? Yeah, that's totally. I'm all for that. <laughs> just like innocent children walking down the road just throw a basketball at him, it's perfect.
<laughs> no, I'm not much on sports, actually. <laughs> Yes, why not? <laughs> yes, violence is the best, obviously. I changed my mind. I'm gonna make them now. Okay, I'm gonna end stream. So, thank you for joining, everybody. Just try not to catch the kitchen on fire when you're baking bread. Make sure there's no gunpowder in the oven. Goodbye.